Welcome to the Northwest Adventure, and today's episode is It's Time to Go Fishing! So I've made it to West Haven State Park in Westport, Washington and I'm traversing the terrain at the Westport Jetty. If you're not familiar with the Jetty, Google it and you'll learn some interesting facts about this structure that was built in 1902 and it is supposed to be about 18,000 feet long. So how many miles is that? I'm not sure, but you'll have to do the math. If I recall correctly, a mile is about 5,280 feet, so I guess you'll have to divide it up somehow. Anyways, what I wanted to let you all know is that bottom fishing opens up on the second Saturday of March 2022, which will be this coming Saturday on the 12th. So I hope you all are geared up and ready for some rock fishing because I sure as heck know that I am. Are you ready to go fishing? Let me know in the comments if you're going to head out to the Westport Jetty, to the North Jetty at Ocean Shores, or to one of my favorites, the North Jetty in El Waco, Washington. And if you're not familiar with the location of the Westport Jetty, it's about two hours and 40 minutes southwest of where I live in Edmonds, Washington. Heads up. It's all right. And remember, when you're out here, not only do you bring a life preserver, but wear eye protection. You don't want anybody's fishing pole and lures to poke your eye out. Now, do you? I didn't think you did. So if this is your first time checking out the Northwest Adventure channel, I want to let you know that I've got over 39 videos that are specifically made for salt water fishing. All right, here we go. Here comes something a little special. Surfers at nine o'clock. Let's see if these boys can ride this set. I doubt it. Have any of y'all ever surfed the Westport area? Probably not the ones they're looking for. All right, y'all. It's time to go fishing. Hopefully it's a good spot with no other fishermen. And here's why. <laughs> uh -oh. I'm over here somewhere. If you're not paying attention, it's real, real easy <laughs> to get snagged up on somebody else's lines. Another thing, it takes you out of your good fishing spot for you to get it untangled, but I've usually only met nothing but good people out here, so that's what's up. Let's see. Okay. All right. I, I see it right there. It appears the current Whew. took their lure my way. So what that tells me is they weren't jigging. They were probably just letting whatever it was float. Okay. All right. Woohoo. <laughs> Woo. And whatever you do, do not okay. fall into the ocean. The Pacific Ocean, that is. And now that my lead head came back all chumped up like Mac Nuggets. I'm going to have to set up a new lure real quick, so bear with me, folks. Bear with me. And the knot I'm using today is called the clinch knot improvised. And I'll be using a lead head jig with a rubber swim bait. These work great as they bounce off the rocks. What do you guys use when you're fishing off the jetty for rock fish? You guys use the white ones, the black ones, the maroon ones, where you go with these high viz colored ones that I like to use. So if you're wondering what time of the day the Westport Jetty is open, well, during the summertime, the hours are from 8 a.m. to 
to 10 p.m. And in the winter, it's also 8 a.m., but shuts down early at 6 p.m. So I don't recommend hanging out on the jetty when it's dark because the rocks will play tricks on you. So not only can you catch and keep rockfish, you can also catch and keep a daily limit of two ling cod. And if you're not familiar with ling cod, it's a well-known delicacy. Some really ugly but delicious tasting fish. So if you haven't had any, you better get your butt to the jetty. And according to the WDFW fishing rules and regulations, the daily limit of bottom fish is a total of nine. And that excludes surf perch and flatfish. So check the regs so you know exactly what you can and cannot fish for. Capiche? So now that all the shucking and jiving is over with, it's time to go fishing. So if you see me at one of the jetties, either at the North Jetty, Ocean Shores, the Westport Jetty, or the North Jetty at El Waco, stop by, say hello. Until then, it's the Northwest Adventure. And if you like what you see, go ahead, subscribe to me, ring the bell, and hit them likes. So until then, stay fresh and stay blessed. Beats by AC, the program director. Tight lines, y'all.